When it comes to excellence, art represents external excellence, and virtue represents internal excellence. For someone to master the art of gymnastics would require thousands upon thousands of hours of habitual practice in order to do so. No different than someone who masters the art of sales, teaching, speaking, writing, running, music, medicine, baking, or anything else for that matter. Habitual practice is required to become a virtuoso performer at whatever art you set your mind to. In the same way, for someone to be a person of moral excellence, they must habitually practice it. To attain the virtue of courage, one must habitually perform courageous acts. In time, one will become a virtuoso of courage and find it nearly impossible to not do the courageous act when the opportunity presents itself. To acquire the virtue of honesty, one must habitually perform honest acts. Eventually, one will become the virtuoso of honesty and find it nearly impossible to not do the honest act when the opportunity presents itself. Virtue, then, is a habitual and stable disposition toward the moral good. It's not something that can be developed overnight, just like you can't become a world-renowned rock climber overnight. It takes consistent and persistent practice until it's solidified concretely into your character and stamped into your soul.